obviously Lifetime, it's big for us. It's a general entertainment channel. I can't believe somebody's taking video of this. It's scaring me. Um, it has four pillars. And by the way, who was here at the launch of Lifetime? Who was here at the launch party? Was anyone here at the launch party? Right? We're not giving away a trip. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. Nina, how are you? I'm alright. How are you I'm managing. I'm managing. Like I said, this is not my day job. This is not my day job. I got thrown into this last minute. So you've been here, what, uh, three or four days now? Yeah, it's day four. Day four. First time to Malaysia? First time to Malaysia. I gotta ask, how's it been? It's been wonderful, minus the humidity. Um, everything else has been wonderful. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, people are so warm. Last and night here, we had uh, almost an incident. You were mobbed almost, it seemed. Like extra security out. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm glad that I didn't get to say, you know, thanks to all the people that came last time, but oh, next time. I'll next questions, I'll float around, you can grab me, I'll give you the mic and ask your question. Now, you're going to make, what is it again? So, I'm making a tamarind, um, garlic, chili prawn, and it's really flavored, so it's got lemongrass through it, but we'll go through the recipe anyway to get that. Okay, now the first question I have for you yeah. is, I'm actually allergic to prawns. I know it's, and I, you know, living in Asia, living in Asia, yes. you know, you smell such great foods, especially oh, yeah. seafood. Yeah. I'm allergic. So if I wanted to put something else, yep. in there, what would I put? Well, I'm guessing you're, if you're allergic to prawns, you're probably allergic to shellfish. Correct. Yes. Um, look, you know, if you're trying to, you can make the spice paste, and then you can add fish to it. Okay. You just braise it slowly. Um, this, I think the um, the spices we use probably won't go very well with chicken. So, stick to seafood. Got it. Yeah. 